Jeremiah, one in five. I am here with the most decorated superstar of all time, Michael Phil. He has 66 gold medals, 14 silver medals, and three bronze. Sure, man. So, if you weren't in swimming, what other careers do you think you'd ever uh, I was a good baseball player, decent lacrosse player, maybe golf. That's what I would dream of. So, how honored is it to be honored at the Carolina Girl Pump Foundation? And my second part to the question is, how does it feel to be able to support the pump? Uh, number one, it's incredible. Um, you know, as a kid growing up, how old are you? Okay, so almost your age. As a kid growing up. I dreamt of, of being able to do everything I did in the swimming pool, and, and now being able to look back at it, it's still kind of mind-blowing. There's times I still have to pinch myself to make sure this is a real life. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not living a dream. Um, and, and the second part of your question, to be able to be here to help somebody be able to save a life, right? Try to forego treatment to learn more about cancer. Right? It's something we we need to learn more about, right? There are people that are that are losing their lives and, and we want to help them. So being able to support something like that where we can make a difference is so important to me. Something like I do, for me, I, I spend a lot of time with mental health and with water safety. Those two things are very important to me. So all of those things together, we want to save a life. And if we can save a life, we can make a difference. So I know that you are friends with Greg Lewis. What was some of your conversations like with Oh man, I wish I was here last year with him. And that man, that man's a special human being to me. Uh, he is he is kind of a brother to me. Uh, known him for a long time and, and the discussions that we have, we've had throughout our 22 years of knowing each other and being friends and being brothers, um, they've been incredible and they've been life-changing conversations uh, about the love for our city, but also just how we can help each other and how we can how we can all help one another. And my final question to you is, if you had one, who is your childhood idol? Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan was number one. Uh, what he did in the sport of basketball is what I wanted to do in the sport of swimming. And then, whenever, like, if he was sick or didn't feel good or this or that, nothing mattered. He left everything on the court. And that's how I, that's how I went about my career. So he was somebody I idolized, and I think we're getting close. So, me personally, I would like to tell you that since arguably Michael Jordan is the GOAT at basketball, I would like to say that you are arguably the GOAT at basketball. Oh, thanks, man. Thank you so much. I appreciate you.